What's up, everybody? I'm Shane. You're watching Treasure Train. Last night we camped out here at a uh, Coolgardy again. Last night I got some samples right here. Got my samples bags over here. Can't really take you out, get all the samples because on this guy can't really carry everything all around. But I might try and take you over there and show you where I got them from. Show you my hole over here. We've been working since five o'clock in the morning. We had some rain last night for a few hours. Wasn't that fun? Yeah, a, look at my hole right here. You've already moved a whole bunch of dirt. Just working these gravel layers in here pretty much. All through here is gravel layers. Just down to this hard stuff like usual. Okay, this is our hole so far. Pretty much started where Justin was at digging today. Pretty much right at that little point and moved all that dirt today. Got a dry washer moved down another level. A lot of dirt moved today. We're looking good. The concentrate bucket. I think we've done like four or five runs, maybe. Maybe five runs. Looking good. I'm not going to do any panning today. I didn't even bring anything to pan stuff out with. We're just going to pan it out at home. Split it up. Pan it out. I'll show you that when I get to it. Here we go. Another run going. Got all picked up. The motor sounds crazy today. I don't know if it's getting dust in there or dirt in there or what, but I'm sure I'm working it today anyways. Hey, you can come get yourself a dry washer and you bring your buddy out here and he can dig all day for you. <laughs> That's how you work it. Alright, goes look at our hole again. Just got done with another run. It was probably like sixth run or something, maybe. But, uh, yeah. We got about one more in us or something. Actually, Justin's all excited that we just saw a flake in the tray right now a pretty nice one i forgot to film it but yeah, he's all excited he said we got a lot of more dirt to move here's our last run here actually steve came out here he's gonna do a little bit of digging nice little hole. we moved a lot of dirt today all the way from justin to the front the hole probably about 10 feet long at least probably about 10 feet wide too in spots three or four feet deep too two to three two to four feet deep all the way around finally get the hole. okay started right here all the way to there Yeah, it seems like everybody out here, everybody from the club is out here today. But yeah, this is where I got my first sample from. All right, here. I guess old Gary, the guy that lives out here, he was the one digging on this hole. And it sure does look nice. He sure cleaned it up good. And he kind of told me to dig in here. They were over here talking. And he said, yeah, man, digging all this gravel layer right here. Where it all kind of peters out. Seen that type of section. Oh, that's good. Pretty sure this is my second test hole right here. It looks a little different because some guy was over here digging this morning. And I probably won't be coming back here and I ain't going to jump in his hole. He already has this whole thing dug out. I feel bad if I jump in his hole. 
But I definitely got a test from there. See what's coming out. He actually said he got a little picker. I mean, a little nugget actually from this area. But that's my second test bag. Okay, this is where my third bag came from. Larry Engelhart should know this spot. I've been wanting to come to this spot. Yeah, I just got a little bag from right up here. Hey, Larry was taking all this stuff before, but I just got a little thing from right here. A little sample. I've seen Larry get some good gold out of here, so. So I always want to try this spot and find it. And yeah, it might not be on the claim. Actually, it might not be on my Desert Gold Diggers claim. Let's look at that. We just spotted this tortoise here is driving along. It's kind of hiding in the shell. I'm kind of scaring him. I'm kind of going to leave him alone. But that's pretty cool. Okay, man. Just made it back home. About to pan out my concentrates here. This is my half. I gave the other half to Justin. Split it up. And about to pan my stuff out right now. Show you what I get after I'm done panning it. Here's my first pan. Let me work it back for you. It's working pretty good. Looking pretty good. A lot of stuff showing up in the corner. All through there. That was just the first pan. Looking good. It's getting a little hard to pan out, but you can tell what I'm getting in there. This is the second pan. It's looking pretty good still. Nothing too big today, but it's looking pretty good. Hopefully, Justin got some bigger stuff. I was hoping for some pickers today. Still looking good. All right, this is the third pan right here. I just gotta show you guys real fast because it's starting to rain out here. Got a big old cloud up here. It's about the same as the other pans. It really is. There's some bigger pieces in there, smaller over here. No pickers today though. So that one's almost a picker. Here comes the rain, I gotta get out of here. I'll show you guys the rest later. On a different video, I'll do the good cleanup. Oh, I told you it was about to rain.